Good day, everyone, and welcome back to Vault Hunter Skyblock Edition. Now, um, I'm gonna, I think we're going to have a lot going on this episode here. We're finally going to uh, get a piece of equipment that hasn't been here. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to locate it here or if I'm going to locate it here. I'm leaning towards here because when we get a computer system, I can set it up to automatically import all of it into the drawer system. Um, so you're probably wondering what the heck is it that we are talking about here? What, what am I so excited about that we're going to get? Well, I'm going to tease you a little bit. Uh, I'm not going to get straight to it. Instead, we're going to do something else here. Um, but it's going it, to it, it all kind of comes together. I assure you on that. So I looked at the bounties before we got started here and uh, I noticed that we can actually complete all three of these item submissions. So let's start with the uh, polished vault stone. Uh, let's just take that. Um, let's get our vault stone here. Boom, 274, done. I actually had started on this the last episode, if you recall. Um, so the next one on the list here is 126 gold. We've been holding on to this for a while. Let's go ahead and activate that. Let's get our 126 gold here. Uh, I'm just going to take it all. I'm not going to count. All right, we're good. And that leaves us with some gold left. I mean, honestly, we probably won't need it unless, you know, the uh, next uh, vault crystal requires it, which I can assure you it doesn't. I've got that all ready to go. I've confirmed we have everything we need, so it's not going to be a problem, which is nice. All right, and then uh, they want 68 iron. Well, that's certainly going to be the 68 iron. Boom. There should be an achievement for uh, completing uh, bounties that quickly and stuff. I mean, we, we got through them quickly. Unfortunately, we're not going to get any uh, bounties for a while, but um, these were actually worth it. Um, so let's go over here and open these up. Uh, in fact, how can I do this in an overly dramatic fashion? Hmm. Let's place one down here. We'll place one down here and we'll place one down here. Now let's just go through them here. Um, so boom, the first one. Oh, it went in the pouch. Um, hang on. Yeah, so we got 49. Let me turn off the auto pickup. Oh, I actually had a chromatic steel nugget in there. How nice. Um, so from that, we got 60 emeralds, 10 silver, and 49 chromatic iron. Um, honestly, I mostly did this for the chromatic iron, but having the uh, vault silver is pretty good as well. Same with the 60 emeralds, because I just recently used a bunch of emeralds here with uh, my equipment. Although I didn't do my sword and pick, a, ah, that's fine. We can have a shiny sword. So with this uh, bounty crate, we got some more uh, emeralds, which is nice, but we also got some vault diamonds and uh, some knowledge essence. Let's turn off auto pickup. I know what everyone's going to say here. You know, you're you're going to forget to be, you know turn on the auto pickup on that stuff again, and uh, you'll probably be right. We also got a chip gem somewhere in all this. Um, that is honestly the last thing I cared about. Uh, and then finally, if we open it up here, we got some diamonds. I don't really care about those, but more emeralds, sure. And uh, an unidentified vault axe. Again, not something I care about, but let's go ahead and roll that. And uh, we're, we might be using it as an example here. Oh, no, sorry, never mind. We can't use it for that example. Yeah, it's... Well, the stun attack's kind of neat, but... Um, as expected, it's not that great. Oh, yeah, from scrapping a jewel. Although I don't think I'm going to be scrapping jewels much anymore. Also, that's changed in terms of uh, that whole process. You know, you so um, we're going to cover that eventually. Um, the whole jewel system. I kind of talked about it in one of the updates, but we're going to talk about it more. Um, so we took care of the bounties. Um, the next thing on the to do list is something I've been waiting for, and this is the big. This is the big thing that I was leading up to. To you guys, it may not seem like a big deal, but to me, this this is a big deal. This is a very nice big deal. So uh, what we're actually going to be doing here uh, is um, 
you may have gotten a little bit of a hint here, but I used the uh, bounty table here to make a little acquisition. Actually, let's... Uh, uh, yeah, let's just put the rest of this stuff here, really, because we're going to need the inventory space. Uh, we were low on chromatic iron as a result of what we're going to be working on. Well, low is relative. Um, what was it that I got? It was knowledge essence, bolt diamonds. That's on the other side. And the coins, the coins. The coins are in the compacted drawer there. And so we'll put the knowledge essence that. Um, oh, yeah, there was a single nugget. Let's do that. And the chip jewel. It's going to be a keeper. I'll just... You know what? We're just going to throw it over here because this is what we're working on. So I was able to get um, a soul flame through the bounty table. I already had one, but I want to keep one on hand just, you know, to have. Um, I want to make sure I have one. Uh, we're not going to get into uh, the usage of them outside of what we're going to be making. But we're going to finally make a soul diffuser. And this is something that, oh, I've wanted it for a long time because it, it's a great way of getting uh, more shards and then being able to buy more stuff on the bounty table. Unfortunately, it's incredibly expensive. This is all the stuff we're going to need here. Uh, we're going to be converting all of this into uh, more chromatic um, steel uh, because we're going to need a ton of chromatic steel because we're going to be making... Um, is it black chromatic steel? Whatever it's called. Hang on. Let, let's see here. What is it called again? It's... Uh, do, do, do. This isn't what I wanted. Oh, there it is. Yeah, black chromatic steel ingots. Oh, I hate these. These are the worst of all the stuff in Vault Hunters. The thing that gets me the most is just how much you're dependent on uh, black chromatic steel for the fun stuff because the steel itself is painful and then you got to use up all of your black opals. Now, I really would like a drawer controller and that's going to require for um, black chromatic steel as well. However, the way I see it, we are waiting on a certain gem. Yeah, no tubium. I, I've every time I've gone in there, absolutely nothing. Uh, so the way I see it, by the time I get a nice tubium to make our pog for uh, the uh, drawer controller, we'll probably have more black opals. So I'm not too worried about it. Instead, I'd rather have a soul diffuser so that we can get more shards and possibly buy more neat stuff on the black market. Of course, right now the black market doesn't isn't offering anything you know too great, but it gets better. So uh, let's start with the steel here. Uh, so what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to split it like so. And I'm thinking I did this right. If I didn't, it doesn't really matter. We're gonna have a ton of chromatic steel here to work with. Um, so next we're going to make our, um, yep, I did this right. So we're going to make our black chromatic steel ingots. I know all that just for four. Ew. It's so painful. Um, okay. We're going to need that and we're going to need that. Let's just take everything here. Um, so the first thing we actually have to make here is we actually need to make a recycler. Um, right. These go up here. And we take the five here like so. All right, so there's our Volt Recycler. We get to keep the bucket at least. Um, from there, it's, uh, I think it's like, is it like that? Yep, there we are, Volt Diffuser. I mean, I've made it, you know, a cut only a couple of times. And I think we're gonna plop it, yeah, we're gonna plop it right there. Um, it's a little ways away from here, which we're go I think we're gonna regret in the long run. Um, yeah, sorry about this. This wasn't planned, but I want to be it's going to be important because we're going to change this to a compacting drawer soon, I think. Um, it's very good with the shards to have a compacting drawer, especially when you automate uh, the storage here. Um, so now what we can do with the soul diffuser is uh, let's see here. Uh, what can we use it on again? Um, I mean, we can I'm trying we can use it on pretty much. Boy, it would be so broke if we could use it on the unobtainium. Um, let's see here. What, what's something that I have a lot of? You know what? Hang on. I think... Yeah. So if we take um, one of the blessings... Actually, let's take one of these. Oop. Let's just take what we have, you know, 
uh, uh, one of. Um, and we put it in here. It's going to convert into soul dust. If we take the soul dust, which we can automate with a uh, compacting drawer, um, and we throw it in, you know, same, you know, the usual nine by nine. I should just do it that way. Or sorry, three by three. Boom. We now got 14 shards out of it. And of course, it's not there. Hmm. You know what? We're going to move this. The black market needs to move. Um, we're going to put the black market there. That makes sense. Yeah, as long as I can... Yeah, th this works. This works. Okay. I mean, it's such a little thing, but this is, this is something I've been really wanting. Okay, we're in the vault. It's going to be a free monolith. And before anyone says it in the comments, guess what? I did enable it. So uh, we've got automatic pickup. Good to go. Uh, let's see here. Um, can we go down? We probably can go down. Looks like we can go down. We're going down. Already that mastery. Uh, for the undead paid off. I mean, it, it's probably the best one you can get. Looks like we have a good mining opportunity down here. Um, let's just clear the area first, I think. Chaining it. Undead mastery. Lovely. Uh, so yeah, we're going to clear the area before we mine. Uh, just, you know, it makes it safer. It makes it easier. Yeah, I don't think... I think we're just wasting our time down here. We need to go back up. Because there's just no ores down here. We just got some tubium out of this. That was it. Five tubium. We need to be maybe... Alright, there'll probably be some black opal in there. Part of the problem is... Um, you know, some of the good stuff, you just gotta wait. You know, you start getting it more later. I was misclicking there. Too soon, too soon. Uh, yeah, so no black opal, you know, just, just a bunch of, uh, you know, armor and beniotite, basically, and a whole bunch of vault cobblestone. Um, overall, overall, though, I mean, yeah, we also got some alexandrite and some, uh, lutatite and painite. Uh, so, you know, I can't complain, it's just that it's, it, we're doing fine on most of that. Uh, oh, this looks promising. I mean, we, we could get some more good stuff here. Um, let's start at the top, kind of, here. Ooh. Yeah, I'm starting to think that the best vaults for mining are actually... Oh, that's nice. Um, we gotta get up there somewhat. There's Benny a tight at available. So yeah, I mean, how can you complain about, you know, or, you know, not getting mining opportunities? Well, I'm not complaining about not getting them. Not getting. I'm not complaining about getting mining opportunity. Not getting. Yeah, I said it right the first time. Oh boy, double negatives. Um, it's just that, okay, we're going to have this vault pretty easily completed. I like it when they're easy. I, uh, as you know... That was the thing I disliked the most about, you know, the previous Vault Hunters, is that not all the vaults were necessarily completable. Uh, you know, some were just actually impossible because there was no, um... You know, they just didn't spawn the stuff. We got ourselves a nice little party here. Look at all of our friends who came up to... Uh, have some fun with us. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Boom. Alright, uh, hopefully we can, uh, get some carbon out of this.
Okay, what's up there? I didn't pay attention. Um, it's all wooden chests. Uh, we'd be better off probably finding um, some more Nate chests. Oh, my, bleh, mining. Mm, eh, food thing. Mm. <laughs> all right, let's see here. Uh, what do we get? Ah, uh, just basically a bunch more Lara Martin. Uh, I can never have enough Lara Mar, apparently. What do we have here? It's, all right, so it's going to be gilded, it looks like. Yep, gilded. This doesn't do gilded, does it? No, wood and living. I have to keep checking that because... Uh, I really gotta show off my other playthrough. <laughs> uh, I think I think we're gonna. That's either gonna be next on Monday, or it's gonna be sometime next week. I think we're gonna do that. Actually, you know what? Let's just. Oop! That would have been bad. That would have been bad. Uh, let's just throw some stuff in that we don't need. Oh, the rest of it's pretty much good stuff. All right. Anything worth it down in the lower levels? I see some more Nate. That could be fun. Oh, here's our third one. Oh, we got an archer. That's not good. Whew, thank goodness for chaining on that, because uh, I just couldn't get to the archer. Okay, oh darn. This is a problem, because how many kills do we need over there? And I think we set off the spawner down there. All right, let's just uh, let's see what we can do here. All right, we completed the altar. Oh, we got uh, we got an altar scroll. All right, so it sounds like the entrance is around here. That's probably it. Okay, we are, f you know, this place is um, completely uh, free for us to do what we want with. Um, I think we can take a look in here. Oh, it's over here, right. But we're not gonna Okay, maybe we are going to. Okay, we're gonna have to back out here because uh, this is the one. You gotta skirt the side, I think. Okay, so once again, this wasn't quite the one I thought it was, but that's all right. I think we actually cleared it. Yep, we're good. We didn't have to cheese it too bad. Ooh, okay, so unidentified vault leggings. Um, let's throw the andesite in there. We don't need stone bricks. Yeah, we'll get rid of the cobble as well. Um, which chest was it? This one. Oh, we got some that need... Uh... Okay, there we go. Boop, boop. This is a nice ornate chest here. I mean, we're getting some stuff that is sometimes a pain for me to get. So that's nice. So we got a helmet to accompany that. Uh, let's throw that in here like so. Um, oh, that might not have been the wisest uh, decision to do that in here. 
Okay, uh, we're done with this uh, area. Don't have a lot of time left, but we should be able to do a little bit more. Okay, we got a bunch of wooden chests down here, but I don't... E well, even with Vein Miner, oh, it's kind of risky. Let's go for it. Sounds like it was worth it there. And we'll just get the last one. Okay, hang on. I do see some... Um, let's do that. Just clear a little bit of space. I knew it. I knew it. One of them was going to be poisoned. I knew it. Oh, boy. Is there anything else down here? I don't think so. Let's head on uh, up here. Um, honestly, three minutes. We can take a look at the upstairs, probably, if it's easily accessible. Alright, I see the end. I see how to get upstairs. So yeah, if there's, um, if there's a mining opportunity, it will be worth it. Gotta get our spawner here. Oh, I miss getting five. You don't get five later on. No, it becomes seven and more. Alright, keep an eye on the time there. I don't think there's anything... Is there anything? I, I've never seen this set uh, up here before. Um, there might be something there. There might not. Um, let's just vein. Okay, so a bunch of wooden chests. I'd rather uh, get the ore. Alright, we don't have a lot of time here, so... A minute 57. I see uh, something good there. Oh, please. How many? Only one. Darn. Alright, well, there might be more. If we have to use a lemon, it will be worth it if we can get more black opal. Because <laughs> we need it. Another one black opal. Uh, that's... Oop. Well, that worked. Forgot that I had that also set up there. Um, what do we got here? Is it good? The answer is probably not. In fact, let's just leave. We got a minute left, but we can probably make it back in a minute. It's just a straight run. I guess I didn't need the kiwi, but I did. I, I kiwied, but I guess I didn't need to. Um, yeah, that was. Uh, ooh, you know, I need to pick that up. That was that, that was pretty good. Um, that was a success. So that's gonna bring us to twenty four and twenty two. So yeah, let's not let's not increase that death counter. 